Good morning, afternoon, or evening, ladies and gentlemen. We made it through the first week. How's everybody doing today? I hope your guys' first week has gone smoothly. Mine had some challenges here and there, but ultimately we made it through. We got through. We are, after today, we are done with the first week of remote learning. Pat yourselves on the back, guys. Go ahead. You made it. You did it. You were successful at it. Great job, guys. Fantastic job. Um, if any of you are still struggling, reach out to me if you got any questions. Um, I can't help you with anything I don't know is a problem, so please reach out to me. All right, guys? Um, for today, here is what I what we are going to do. Um, we talked about yesterday how the fight over the National Bank and why the National Bank was something that Hamilton wanted to create. Today, we're going to take a look at how the National Bank was approved. That's going to be the lesson for this very beautiful, very wonderful Friday. Okay, so uh, the goals for today, oops, sorry guys. The objectives for today, uh, we are going to discuss how Washington, his cabinet, and Congress agreed to make the National Bank a reality. And then we are going to listen, we are going to listen to a song from the musical Hamilton to help us better understand the deal that was made between Hamilton, Jefferson, and Madison. And I will have those lyrics posted, guys. I do have those lyrics posted to Google Classroom so that you can follow along as the song is being sung, like you did hopefully yesterday uh, with Cabinet Battle Number 1. My office hours again today, guys, are the same as yesterday, 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. and 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. if you have any questions. Okay? So here's a slide that I'm going to be posting this video on. And then I have a short 10-minute video. I know I did a lot of talking yesterday. It might have seemed long. Today is going to be much shorter. It's going to only be about 10 minutes uh, explaining how the National Bank was approved. So what I want you guys to go ahead and do is just make sure you watch the video. And then after you watch the video, uh, you can look through these couple of slides, read through them if you like, or you can go ahead and skip right to the uh, song from Hamilton. Parents, just so you know, there is no uh, school and appropriate language in this song. You can absolutely let your child listen to this song. There are no issues, no problems. Um, so guys, feel free to go ahead and listen to this song. This will give you a good idea of how that agreement between Hamilton and Jefferson and Madison was reached. So you can go ahead, listen to that song, listen to it as many times as you want. You should enjoy it. Uh, it should be a pretty good song. Uh, most of you guys should enjoy it. Uh, unless you do hate Hamilton, then I'm sorry you guys are kind of out of luck. Sorry about that. Uh, but you guys should be able to watch this. It shouldn't be a problem. Um, and you should enjoy it, hopefully. Once you're done with that, once you've had your fill of Hamilton, you can go ahead and complete the exit ticket. It's only one question. Uh, shouldn't be too huge of a deal. Uh, you can submit it and then make changes if you go back and look and want to fix something. Okay? So uh, here is uh, your practice. Uh, so listen to the Hamilton song like you did last time. And don't forget your Unit 7 key terms are going to be due on the 30th on Monday. All right. The resources for this class were the Hamilton song and uh, the power, couple of PowerPoint slides that I made uh, like I did yesterday. So that's really all there is to today, guys. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to email me during my office hours, 10 a.m. to 11 a.m., 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. Uh, if you have any questions. Um, guys, I hope you all enjoy your weekend. Uh, I hope you all have a fantastic weekend. Take the couple of day break. You earned it. You deserve it. Make sure you have your key terms uh, shared with me by Monday. Um, other than that, guys, I hope you have a fantastic weekend. Uh, and for anybody that has missed out on it or was looking for it, here is a high five because you are awesome. Feel free to give me a high five. All right. Perfect. You guys have a great weekend. I'll catch you on Monday.